Hello friends, welcome to my channel and today we are going to see one more concept in Kubernetes which is how to assign pods to nodes. Right? And we are going to see two ways of doing it. One is node selector and other one is node affinity. We already have seen taint and toleration and I would highly recommend that you watch that video first and then come to this video. Right? And I'll put like in the description, I'll put the link to that video. So it is like quick access for you, right? Okay, I'll not go into taint and toleration. I don't want to hijack this tutorial for that discussion because we already covered it very well in our earlier tutorial. So what is node selector? So node selector or node affinity are the ways where you are telling pod where you should uh, sit or where that pod should be hosted. Uh, like uh, I want to create a pod and it should be hosted on node 1 instead of node 2. This is one scenario. Or I want to create a pod and it should be uh, like hosted on node 1 or node 2. So these are uh, like uh, two scenarios. There could be many but I'm just taking two scenarios and I'll uh, like uh, just to explain you that right. So for node selector I have a node which has label this type is equal to ssd so this is a key value pair which is you attached already to your node this type is equal to ssd and when you are creating this nginx pod what you are doing is you are giving node selector as this type is equal to ssd so what all you are saying uh, telling in this uh, yaml file is create a pod and host it on the node where you have a label disk is equal to ssd so node selector is very simple to uh, write and say simple to understand um, but we cannot do multiple uh, uh, permutations and combination here that like uh, wherever node has this type is equal to ssd put my pod there that is as simple as that right but if you want to say okay like put my node like put my pod on the node node 1 or node 2 right with having label uh, xyz is equal to 1 or xyz is equal to 2 right either or either or that you cannot do in node selector you have to rely on node affinity which is complex but it has more possibilities i'll just explain node affinity as well and then we'll go into practicals but for node affinity it is a little complex to understand but you just remember that node affinity is giving you a ability to have multiple combinations of uh, labels so for example key disk type in ssd or it can be cold storage you can just give values which is just an array of things right like values is array here so i can give the list and if your disk type in that list then uh, host my pod on that particular node right and here two variations again one is required during scheduling and ignore during execution what does that say is node when you are putting that like pod on that particular node right it should have like uh, this label right so this label has to be there which is a mandatory requirement for my pod to be sitting on that node if label is not there on any of the pod and you are specifying here in pod definition then that pod will be in status pending you will not able to put that pod anywhere so scheduler will not have any option to put that pod so scheduler will just keep on pending and if you describe that pod definitely like when you create the pod and see it's pending and you describe you can clearly see, uh, see that scheduler is not able to schedule that particular pod right so required during scheduling but what happens when for example there will be, there is a label uh, disk type is equal to ssd you created a pod pod is scheduled and now somebody came and removed that label right so what happens is is clearly call that out that ignore during execution even if that situation happened that after uh, I schedule the pod and somebody removed the label from the node still don't worry don't do anything because you are ignoring during execution so your pod will run as as it is no changes to that right yeah that is required during scheduling and ignore during pod but problem with this is if you don't have label there is no scheduling and there is another variant to it is prefer during scheduling ignore during execution what you're saying is try for having disk is equal to ssd on the node and then create this pod on that particular node but in case you don't find that label there don't worry i prefer to have that but if it is not there don't worry just put wherever you can so that is preferred during scheduling 
and ignore during sh- execution we have already seen it is no difference with that right so these are two variants one is require during scheduling ignore during execution and prefer during scheduling and ignore during execution right and the syntax like you can just uh, ignore the syntax for now but it is just a different syntax and you can easily get in documentation i want you to understand the concept instead of uh, focusing more on syntax of it okay so now let's connect to ec2 instance and see in action whatever we just learned in theory okay so i connected to ec2 instance and i'm setting alias and i'm just showing you this because i don't want you to get confused why i am using k instead of uh, kubectl get nodes and we have two worker nodes one is control plane and two worker nodes so i have this uh, aml file is already in place there so let me just show you that right first is very simple create plot pod with node selector size equal to small so if node has small, size equal to small as a label create my pod there right then uh, required is Uh, node affinity required during scheduling ignore during execution and values i am giving size is medium or small so any of this value is there please go ahead and schedule my pod and the last one i want to show you is prefer right so what i am saying is my preference is like uh, size should be medium and this label should be there on node then schedule it there and what i am uh, adding in the equation right i am adding another uh, like variant to it where i am saying that even size equal to small is okay but if both exist then weightage is more to this preference second preference which is size equal to small right if it is uh, having small as a label then please schedule it there if not then schedule it on medium if medium and small both are there then please schedule it on uh small this is like you uh, like a uh, sp- uh, preference and uh, weightage right it goes into little bit uh, uh deeper into this advanced concept but still if you understand that is well and good but otherwise just think is like we are just saying that i prefer this setting but if in case you don't have it you can schedule it anywhere that is a subtle difference between required during scheduling and preferred during scheduling okay with that said let me see what is uh the, what are the nodes and what are the labels on that nodes so i don't have any labels uh, this, uh, with size so i'm just adding that label in one of the one node so i will just add for this node size is equal to small okay so this label is added now and you can check it like i always uh, prefer checking it just so that we know like we are doing it right oh, size equal to small that label is added okay so let me create this pod now and then i am using create pod node selector dot yaml and i'll give this all this uh, yaml files in uh, git repo i created for this particular series and you will have easy access to it so don't worry of typing it and all that just watch me doing it and if you want to play with it later you can refer uh, github repo and get all the ml files from there okay so this is done and then i want to just show you this required once again right so what i'm saying is it required either medium or small has to be there let me just go ahead and create for with the uh, node affinity okay get for hyphen to why okay so uh, both are running so uh, like this uh, this small right this has a node selector with uh, size equal to small and it is like scheduled on m02 similarly it uh, we don't have any node with size equal to medium but only size equal to small but as we have given both the values right require has put that uh, into this particular node uh, m02 now if say i remove this uh, label from the node right uh, so that's what we have seen right like uh, now we are talking about uh, like ignore during execution right so i explained that ignore uh, during execution means like ignore if somebody removes that particular uh, label from the node node 
fine okay so this is unlabeled right so i removed the label but let's see what happens to our pod and we don't expect anything to happen to it right it should be up and running because that's like execute like ignore during execution is taking effect now so it's not doing any changes okay now let me delete this pod okay this pod is deleted now right what i'll do is i'll just create that pod again and we uh, remember we removed the label already so we don't have a uh, small or medium label but it is required when we are saying like required during scheduling that we know that it is required okay so you can see it's pending right and if i go and describe this describe this pod it's clearly say warning failed scheduling why zero out of three nodes are available nothing is available that means one node is untolerated tent which is like control plane and second doesn't match node affinity or selector right so like uh, that's what it's required but we don't have any label so things will change when we create with preference we just prefer it to have a small or medium as a label but even if it doesn't then don't make it pending please schedule it wherever you can right you can see this preference uh, like node with name nginx pref is running now right so it is not bothering about like whether uh, there is a medium or small size instance or size node but wherever it can schedule it just schedule it because that is just a preference i have i am telling you the preference but if you don't have that option then please schedule it but here it is required during uh, scheduling it can't be scheduled if you don't have that uh, particular label so if i just go ahead and create a label for this right like any of this uh, node like uh, uh, with some size is equal to medium or small doesn't matter either is fine okay then let's see what happens to our pod so for uh, m02 i have given the label so if you see that required uh, pod is now sitting into m02 because i have added label so yeah so the, those are the things one is node selector i just want to summarize it because i know it could be a little complex or little confusing when you are not doing it uh, yourself when you are just watching it right i don't know how much you can grasp in a first uh, watch but if you want right you can just uh, rewatch it and then uh, you will understand it better but just want to summarize there are two things one is node selector and another is node affinity node selector is simple you are giving a selector and giving label uh, size equal to small in your pod definition and you are having that label on any of the nodes right second is node affinity node affinity is like uh, you have more options you can give different operator in not in and you can even give array of things like small medium large whatever right that is node affinity and there are two variances to it what is required during scheduling ignore during execution and prefer during scheduling ignore during execution right i hope you understand this concept and you learn something new hope you learned something new today if so please like this video share leave your comment so that i know this content is helping you don't forget to subscribe and that's now okay See you again with yet another exciting tutorial about AWS. Keep learning, keep sharing what you learn and thanks for watching.